this together. I like that. This is a public service, service announcement. Fuck you. So what is it going to take to spread the green? Yes, forcing every corner of society to pick a side. Declaring no, no, unless we are free, this machine will be prevented from functioning at all. Hello, Delta Magnus! Hi, everyone. My name is Alizy, and I led the walkout for Delta Magnus High School today. I'm really happy that everyone decided to take time out of their day to come out here today and fight for women's rights and fight for abortion rights and reproductive justice in this country. consequence the school could possibly give me for missing one class. Um, I know it was like really scary to like walk out and they were like taking pictures of us, um, but I'm just really glad and I know that like so many people didn't come, but I'm just glad that the people who did come are here and are fighting for what they believe in, which I think is amazing. Everyone here is just amazing. University Prep Valley High School and I just want to say I'm here to like I want to represent my school because most of us couldn't walk out because the same thing we were told that if we walked out we wouldn't be able to walk the stage so I honestly said I'm gonna walk out for my school because whether I walk the stage or not I'm proud of it now we walked out on Tuesday same thing the moment it hit two uh, one of our um, students it was like at two we're gonna walk out we walked out and our teachers were confused they were like what are all these students going where are we going we walked outside of our school and we started chanting and I'm honestly proud because I think that they should keep their rosaries out of our ovaries they should keep them off because they don't get to choose for us we get to choose for us so whether you're a woman men whatever you are you get to fight for your own body. Nobody has control over that, and I want you to chant that out. Nobody has control over your own body. Understood? Yeah. All right, thank you. Um, hi, my name is Ryan, and we came here to support, to represent our school, RFK, because, um, a lot of us couldn't come today because our school wouldn't let us walk out. So we decided to decide to ditch the whole day because we want to show our support for this really important issue. And I'm really nervous to be here, but I'm also really excited and happy because this is just a start and we want to show that our voice is really, is really um, strong and that no one has the right to take your rights to your own body. So thank you. I do agree with Ryan. Like, I think it's unfair for like other people to like decide what to do with my own body, especially since like this will definitely affect my future. I think it's really unfair, and I think it was the right choice for me to ditch school like the entire day because I knew they wouldn't let me out here, and I think I did make the right choice and show my support and stand my ground. Hello, we're here from Pioneer Park High School. Uh, we walked out at lunch to protest the potential overturning of Roe v. Wade. For weeks, people at my school, my friends, have been organizing walkouts to support and show support for women and other people affected by Roe v. Wade. We want, to, we want people to see that we're not gonna let this get overturned and we want to do our part to help. Oh, hi. Um, Crystal Hicks. 
and I'm with like Kensington Park High School. Oh. And I've been here before. What was it like two weeks ago? Right? Yeah. Um, it was like my first time and like my first time ever speaking. And, like it was super scary, but like it was honestly like super nice to like come up and like talk. And um. like super enraging as I mentioned before last time like yesterday I was passing around petitions that we got from someone I'm not sure who it was and I'm like kind of a shy person and I was like scared to go ahead and like ask people to like sign it but then in my seventh period seventh yeah, it was my seventh period, and I went, and I asked people in my class, like, hey, would you guys like to sign it? And then some people signed it, and some people didn't. There was this one guy who said, oh, I'm not going to sign it because it's too political. And I kind of got, like, offended and, like, mad at that because, like, I don't know. It was just, like, super mad. I was just super mad. And then my favorite teacher... And my favorite teacher, she told me, she told me that that's killing human babies. And that, <laughs> that made me super sad because like it's my favorite teacher. She's like super nice, but like, I don't know. It, it just like really, it really hurt. <laughs> but anyways, I got some, some like signatures. It was nice to just like do something like that. And I'm also like sad about the fact that many kids didn't walk out this time. Like, yeah, it's just like super sad. But I'm glad to be here and I'm super happy to be here. And yeah. <laughs> Test the potential overturning of Roe v. Wade. We took the bus all the way from Eagle Rock, 32 stops, so we could voice our rights. The school administration threatened to suspend my comrade here for if they walked out today, which is a violation of our First Amendment right. So, of course, we had to come down and show our numbers show that there are people fighting, putting stuff on the line to maintain our right to autonomy over our bodies. Thank you, yeah, woo! 